Assalamu alaikum, uh, my name is Muhammad Ali Raza and welcome to my YouTube channel Marketing Timber. So uh, today I will discuss about you, uh, not you, I will discuss about uh, uh, like I will not remove this part. I will discuss about like how we can add dynamic image uh, in our flows. Okay, so like we should know how we can do this. Sometimes like we can use uh, by the part Clavio uh, block, uh, but sometimes it's not for So we should be able to uh, handle this situation. So how we can add dynamic image and then dynamic text section. So I will uh, show you how you can do this. So this block is already uh, like in abundant checker flow. So I will preview it to show you like it's working. And if done block is working, that's fine. But if it's not working, so how you can create dynamic image section, how you can create dynamic text section, okay? So let's do it. So first of all, uh, we have to add image section here, like drag and drop. This is the first step okay so then browse image library go to the dynamic image and here we have to add the tag so to get the tag uh preview that flow okay and here i will search control f um, source uh, done and again go back to uh image section browse image library and then dynamic image so here takes the dynamic tag and i will remove the default text here and then click on save so then we have to add the link address here but before doing so uh, before doing this uh, this uh, let's preview and check out either the dynamic block is image block is working or not yes it's working that's perfect so now to add the URL, uh, press Control plus F and search URL and click on this tab, done, and click on the image section and paste it here, okay? And remove the default text here, so yes. And uh, I want to uh, like uh, set here 300 pixel width, done. So let's preview it again. And let's see what is the difference now. I know it will be clickable, but before that it was not. Yes, so now you can see it's clickable. Okay, and the image size is also uh, smaller than previous. So you can adjust that. So now we have to add the text section. So from here, drag and draw the text section below the image. Okay, so and uh, uh, pick up the tags that you want to show. Like if you want to show the item name, so go to the previous section and uh, from here uh, get the tag for the item name mm, click here okay and uh, i will paste it here no this tag is not item yes i think now it's, yes it is so let me search for files Yes, it is copy and paste it here. So now I will copy these tags and go to the text section here that we had it, uh, have, have added before. And from here, I will remove the dynamic uh, like default section. Just give it space here and remove the default text here. Files and make it centralized and then and let's see it's working or not i'm sure it's working and it should so so yes it's working so now check for other profiles and you can mess with the existing dining block okay and if both are showing the same information so it's mean you can remove any one of them okay so the name and the price the same okay so in that way you can add 
dynamic image and you can show that uh, like dynamic product information uh, using these simple steps okay so this is like uh, do it yourself or you can say diy yes so if you are new to, to my channel and uh, you have not subscribed my channel so that's not fair now uh, if you have learned this tutorial, if you have gone through this tutorial, uh, please do subscribe my channel, press the bell icon and share your feedback and uh, stay tuned, stay happy. Thank you.